Yo, what's up guys, and in today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to make this low poly cartoon lamp pole. So maybe if you're making a map and you just want to add lighting to it, uh, I highly recommend adding a lamp pole into your game. A few things I'd like to mention is my Twitter. I post my work there and also like sometimes I post uh, my newest uploads. And then maybe if you want to commission me, uh, I'll put my Twitter in my uh, description. And also, I want to mention my Discord server. That's where I post my videos and also where I have a community. Maybe you can talk to people if you'd like. And also, I just want to say, make sure to like and subscribe. It just motivates me to keep posting. And also, it just keeps you notified for future videos. And yeah, let's get right into this video. So when you're inside of Blender, what you're going to do is go into edit mode. Uh, go on your axis so five and one and then scale on your z axis just like this now what you're gonna do is just select the top part the top face and just bring it down just like that yeah just like this and if you like maybe you can add a loop cut control r to the center and just scale it in just like that that would just be like the middle part for the light pole. And you can just extrude it just like this. Hmm. Let me just scale this. So just select all of it. Uh, scale on the x-axis. And scale on the y-axis. Just to make it more thin. And now you just can select the top. Just like that. And this, uh, this top part. Just duplicate it, uh, yeah, just duplicate it by pressing Shift D. Rotate on your Y axis so it faces the front. And just bring it out like this. So scale on your Y axis and extrude. Just like that. So you're also going to add a loop cut right here just to make it kind of curved. Yeah, just like this. And now what you're gonna do is um you you can add a change it if you want. So just like this, you, you're gonna add um a torus. After that, just bring the segments down. So typically, I go for like around 16 and under 16. Actually, no, 15 and 12 around there, or just make it down and uh, go down a bit yeah something like this is good after that just bring it up scale it in just like that uh scale on your z-axis go to edit mode loop key, rotate just like that uh rotate uh 90 degrees there you go and just like both of them and do it again just like this and let's do it one more time there you go so after you do that just add in we're gonna make the lamp so I just add a cube go into edit mode select the cube's bottom uh, scale it up and extrude again after you do that, what you're gonna do is the same thing, just extrude again. Actually, uh, extrude, scale it, and then extrude again. And you're just gonna bevel this part, just like that. And then you're gonna make the top part. So this one's just gonna be more flatter. Just like this. Mm, yeah, let's just uh just scale this up more on the y axis. Actually, just scale it up. There you go. And now what you're gonna do is just bevel the edges right here. Just like this. And select the faces. 
after you select all your all the faces just extrude and scale it in just like that and just make this a bit more smaller there we go and yeah after that just make sure to shade smooth uh your lamp or lantern dang my bad uh also for the light part what you're gonna do is go to modifiers and click solidify just make the thickness just yeah you could bring up the thickness if you want uh leaving it at one is okay and click apply after that make sure to also change smooth the chain and go to auto smooth and auto smooth it and you can just bring it up to preferably what you like and uh, same thing for the pull so yeah it's something like this is good after that you're just gonna scale down the lamp and connect it right to the chain and yeah that's how you make a low poly cartoony lamp pull inside of blender or roblox studio and let me know your guys' thoughts in the comments and if please if you guys uh, want to see more content just give me ideas on discord and yeah thank you for watching bye